Jennifer? We will not be using the save this week. And you know that breaks my heart. But... It's okay. It's okay. No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Everybody's upset. <laughs> you seem to be okay, though. Yeah, I, I am. I'm very much okay because you know it's like it's not a bad thing. You know, everybody seems to think that being cut is a bad thing, and it's not. It's you know, it's like the beginning yeah. of a new era. And I was a part of history. You know, every year there's a top. 12 and I was a part of this year's top 12. And, but you did wake up yesterday with some type of a gut feeling. Yeah, right? I, I, mean, I did. A, a good friend of mine that was also on the show with me earlier in the season said, when you know you're going home, you just know. And I woke up and I said, I think this might be the end. But I was okay. I was like, you know what? I'm going to spend these last, you know, eight hours or so having a great time. So I spent the whole episode jumping up and down and cheering for Kasim and Daniel and all of them. And I was so, so happy to see those, you know, people go forward because those are my, those are my family. But didn't you want to see you go forward? I did. I did. I wanted to go forward too. But, you know, sometimes you just kind of have to accept that things happen for a reason, and for whatever reason, it wasn't my time to move forward. You're what, 59 with this type of, I mean, you're so <laughs> wise, and you're only 19, you, you right? Are, you are the den mother on you, that yeah. show. I am, yeah, those are those are my babies, especially little Daniel. Little Daniel is my son, so I, I, I wanted to take care of them and, and kind of help them along the way, and I, I was just so thrilled to be a part of such a talented group. Mm -hmm. So I can be upset because, you know, so many more talented people are going further in the process. And, and, and so are you. Yeah. Just yes. that process. Yes, of All right, course. here's the moment. They have the thing where you get to sing for the save. Yes. Most people know at, in this week, there's not going to be a save. It's too early. Yeah, it's too yeah. early. It's too early. Yeah, They're going to save the save. But here you are singing for your save. Maybe when they look up at the sky, we'll be shooting stars just passing by. You'll be coming home with me tonight, and we'll be burning up like the light. Baby, now, you were very happy with the choice of that song and the way you delivered it. Yeah. As you're singing it, and you are you looking at the judges? Yeah, I looked at them. I, I For the most part, I focused on the audience and my fellow contestants because they were so bummed and I was like stop let's have a good time you know like I'm ending the show even if I don't get saved you know this is gonna be the last yeah. thing you hear and this is people need to see so what happens now like where's Serena going what's her life plan I know you're 19 but what's what's next uh, the plan is to just do you know whatever happens I just want to like put out music I want to go out and tour and and really meet the people that put me through you know because these are the people that that voted voted me into the top 12 and and that to me is very important to give back to them do you go home to Nash or not Nashville but outside of Nashville do you go home there you're gonna stay here where do you I'm gonna stay here for a couple of days and kind of enjoy um, LA because I love it here I love it here so much and I'm gonna just have a good time here for a little bit and then I'm gonna go home and then I'm gonna actually go visit a good friend that was eliminated earlier in the show so this I'm is not excited. your first time around right absolutely not T tell no. us about that I have auditioned for American Idol four times and uh, three out of the four I made it to Hollywood week and uh, this was the first time I actually went to the live shows which was always the plan so I did accomplish my goal. You know, your goal. Will you come back next year? I can't right I'm, I've hit the mark right I can't come <laughs> I'm pretty sure America's like that's enough. <laughs> well I don't know because I, I was looking uh, I went on the internet last night. On uh -oh. the interweb. I went on the interwebs last night <laughs> and I see that people are really upset yeah. and, and they think this is an injustice and some people have conspiracy theories. Some people say because they've lowered the age of the singers a lot of very young people are going to vote for a lot of very young people. Well, yeah, that, that could be something, but I, I also know that um, people are going to be upset because, you know, they, they rooted for me, and I appreciate it dearly. But, you know, these things happen, you know, uh, you know, 10 other people are going to go home after me. Mm -hmm. And you're not, it's not always going to be somebody you want because only one person can win. Can you just sum up what this past couple months has meant to you and how you've changed because of it? I've changed so much and, and mostly I've changed because of the people I've been around, because of the staff of American Idol, the Scott Borchetta, Jennifer Lopez, Harry Connick Jr., the contestants. I have changed so much because of them, because they've encouraged me to keep going and to keep my attitude 
attitude and persistence and and I am I'm so happy that I got this experience because well we're so happy I mean, to meet you but too soon I know <laughs> okay, too maybe soon. I'll be back for a lighter for a lighter occasion back. yes you, you know what let's uh are we tossing Lisa we are we're not oh I was gonna have her toss to Lisa no <laughs> because Steve because you're right I'm, here I'm yes. sitting right next to you that's me okay uh, <laughs> Thank you for being with us. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. <laughs> so nice to meet you. Go you know what? Talk to her. Just say, here's Lisa. Lisa. Here's Lisa. Go ahead. Here's Lisa. Oh, go. When we come back, how young is too young for a boy to go into a bathroom by himself? It has a big debate going on. Uh -oh. And a baby in an American flag. Is it a good thing? Is it a bad thing? Is yeah. it disrespecting the flag? We're going to talk about those things and a whole bunch more, Steve. Very good. Thank you. Yeah.